Apparently, I'm, I'm in for a, for a big surprise. <laughs> but when I, when I received a letter asking me to, to be a part of the, of the program, they, they said to, uh, I was going to either toast or roast. I could take my choice. choice. <laughs> a very dear friend of mine. And as I look up and down the day, as I look up and down the day, the head table here, I don't see any friends of mine. <laughs> However, ju judging from what has been said tonight, I assume that you must be the gentleman of whom they're speaking. <laughs> You're Milton Matt, Matt? Well, it's nice to get to meet you. How's your lovely wife? She's an absolute angel. An angel? Well, you're lucky. Mine's still alive. I, start, uh, I started in uh, radio at WHAS. They still have those letters? Yeah. <laughs> when I was 13 years old, and uh, I was not there during any time that Milton <laughs> was there, but I, I met him when I came back uh, for, a, for a visit, and uh, I'm 79 now, so you can, I can't figure out how many years I did. But, well, when I met Milton, being the nice guy he is, he invited me out to his house, and, and I went out to where he told me he lived, I thought, and uh, I rang the front, door, front doorbell, and three or four times didn't get any answer, and I knocked, and I kicked, and I, I never did get any answer, so I, maybe it was the wrong night or something. And so I went out to, to, back out to my car, and uh, a lady raised her raised the window in the back and she said, yes, what is it? I said, does, does Milton and Metz live here? She said, yes, just open the door and get it, put him in the hall. I'll get him in the morning. 